Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about scorpion envenomation. Scorpion is found primarily in the southeastern United States. Like that of Arizona, New Mexico or Nevada area and also the California. But it is found in other state of the United States. Sometimes it may go through the ship as a stowaway to the Michigan state. Dangerous scorpions are also found in many countries like that of the Caribbean, Brazil, India, Mediterranean area, desert of Iraq and Saudi Arabia. They have paired venom glands called tension. The scorpion grabs its prey with its anterior pincher. This is the anterior pincher. Arches its pseudo abdomen. It turns back and it stabs by this sting. Okay, this stinger. So, arches its pseudo abdomen and stabs with its stinger. This is the stinger. This is the tension area. Okay, so scorpion venom, this is injected by this, contains numerous digestive enzymes and several neurotoxins. The neurotoxins can cause alteration in sodium channel flow, resulting in excessive stimulation at neuromuscular junction and the autonomic nervous system. So it is very common under the age of 10 because the children used to play outside. They work with the logs, the pile of logs, and they may get the scorpion envenomation. But it may happen to anyone who come in contact with the scorpion. They usually hide during the daytime. They come out during the night. There is a usual habit they have but in the daytime if anyone can get scorpion envenomation that is also possible clinical presentation we may have common scorpion sting these are like the immediate burning pain tissue inflammation and paresthesia we have dangerous scorpion sting like weakness the features are weakness restlessness diaphoresis diplopia double vision nystagma involuntary oscillation of the eyeball there is excessive sweating diaphoresis hyper excitability muscle fasciculation opistotonus people take the shape of a bow just the head and the and the heel is touching the floor okay or the bed the body will be up like a bow Okay, priapism that is continuous erection of penis. Okay, more than four hours. Salivation, hypersalivation, even rhinorrhea, hypertension, tachycardia, convulsion, paralysis, and respiratory arrest. Cardiovascular collapse, coagulopathy, pulmonary edema, disseminated intravascular coagulation and death. Okay, scorpion envenomation, diagnosis, history of scorpion sting. Clinical signs and symptoms, tap test. The physician tap on the site of stinging, okay, and the patient will get pain. Treatment. Treatment in many cases we need only the simple treatment. If it is there is no systemic effect and local effect, it is managed by oral analgesic and cool compression by intermittent ice packs. We will always look for the airway, breathing, circulation, A, B, C. Okay like any other 
envenomation, airway, breathing, circulation. We must treat the hypertension like the anti-hypertensive drug like prazosin. Tachycardia convulsion should be managed. Cleaning the wound and tetanus toxoid tetanus toxoid prophylaxis is required. Antivenom is the FDA approved anas crop. Okay, so it is wise to call the Arizona Poison and Drug Information Center or we can call the National Poison Control Center in case of scorpion envenomation. They will guide us what to do and they are present 24 7 so anyone can get help from the national poison control center prevention by protecting the home from scorpion by maintaining the roof or the window so the scorpion may not may not come inside the home the log should if it is present outside it should be checked properly before getting the log inside the home so prevention is very important and also if the child is has got the scorpion envenomation we look at the diaper of the baby sometimes scorpion may hide in the diaper it may bite again or it, it may sting again so prevention is also good for the to prevent scorpion envenomation and that's all about the scorpion and venomation. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me. Please share the information with your friends. Please support my channel. Please subscribe me. Have a nice, wonderful and blessed day. Bye now.